welcome back to my youtube channel uh in this video i wanted to share with you a beginner friendly and very affordable korean meal that is very healthy today i'm at this very simple restaurant that i walked so much to find but i really love it because as you can see on their menu they have um the korean names and also the english names on like below the meals so i think this is really good for like foreigners that cannot read the korean they are able to know which food they are actually ordering yeah so this is actually really cool so the food is kimchi chige <laughs> so this is kimchi stew it's a very healthy meal so the main ingredient in this meal is kimchi kimchi is a uh, fermented vegetable most times they use cabbage or radish so in this one they use the cabbage they also add other ingredients which makes it like a very full meal and also the meals in korea come with side dishes uh, most of them are free so those other things you see on the small plates are side dishes they give them to you for free it also has tofu and meat and mushrooms so it's a really healthy meal oh it's spicy so if you do not like spicy food maybe you can skip this or ask them to make it less spicy for you it comes in super hot it comes in like when it's boiling still boiling on the plate so you really need to watch out it's hot and the soup is really good most of the times i go for it because of the soup to you know eat with my rice for me soup makes me feel like i'm having a real meal that's why i always go for this so the rice at this restaurant was free it came with a meal though in some restaurants you buy the rice separately they sell it most times for like 1001 or 2001 but this one came with a meal which is nice i think if you want more then that's when they charge you but the first one is free okay so next let me share with you the side dishes that they may offer every restaurant is different every restaurant gives different side dishes so here the first one i'm going to show you is the bean the bean sprouts <laughs> bean sprouts are very nice i like the ones that are mixed with pepper and are kind of spicy these ones were just boiled with salt but still very good and very crunchy i think they really help you to push the food that's why i really like them and then also they add the tofu and mushrooms i mentioned them earlier this is the only time i get to eat tofu and mushrooms i do not cook them but they are very healthy so this is a good time to, for me to try them and i think it would be good for you to try them too they're really good with the sauce so when you get the chance i hope you'll be served with the kimchi stew that has them I've noticed that most kimchi stews okay come with the tofu but actually not all of them come with the mushrooms so i think it depends on the restaurant like many of the ones i've eaten from do not have mushrooms but the mushrooms are really good <laughs> also in case you are ever in a korean restaurant and you need cutlery just go to the side of your table and you just slide it out and most times that's where the cutlery and the tissues are and get what you need so the next like, dish is the acorn jelly um i've tried this before but i didn't like it and the good thing about the korean restaurants is that they give you a lot of side dishes so you can eat what you want and leave what you don't
this other side dish that looks like grass it's they are scallion onions and they add paper to them to make them a little bit spicy and they are so good So whenever you go to a Korean restaurant and there is something like self corner or self service or self, it means that you can just go there. Most times it's for rice or side dishes or water. So it just means that you can go there and get more when you need it for free. Yeah. Okay, so now I'll just go ahead and enjoy the meal. It was a really nice meal. I enjoyed it. After a long day, you really need a nice meal like this one So I'm done with the meal, I was able to finish my soup and I didn't really finish the bean sprouts because they got salty towards the end and I didn't really try that other side dish. Also in Korea most times every table gets a free jug of water, you don't need to pay for it. Um, in case you find your table has no water or you drank all your water, let's say you are in a group, you can always just like ask the restaurant people to bring you another jug of water yeah most times you just need to buy the other drinks but water is free nice totally recommend it to you guys uh, let me know if you'd like me to do more of such videos where i recommend meals to you guys also korea's summer is like very hot oh my god the sun is like always burning anyway so let's go grab the subway and that will be the end of this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe i'll see you in the next video bye guys mm -hmm.